What is going on guys? It is our human games here and welcome back to the channel for another video. Hopefully you guys are having an awesome day now in today's video We are finally Reviewing a G Fuel flavor that is a, a Sealed tub that I have not gotten a chance to try yet I've tried the initial flavor of it and what it's supposed to be because this tub is a reskin But I haven't tried this version of it. So today we are trying the berry bomb G Fuel flavor, which is a reskin of Phase Berry, because if you guys don't know, uh, they reskinned it, uh, and it's Berry Bomb. I believe it's up on the website right now, and yeah, this is gonna be really cool. I haven't had, you know, Phase Berry in forever. Um, it's been a while since I've actually cracked open a new tub. Uh, so we're gonna do that here today. So I'm super excited about that. So what this flavor is, is basically a berry medley. So what they say on the website is it's a strawberry and blueberry mix. Um, and that's what you get on the tub. Let's go ahead, we'll take a 360 of this tub real quick, if it wants to focus in on it. It's all right. We'll take a 360 real quick. You guys can get the gist of it. Yeah. That's the tub right there. Uh, and like I said, it's a berry medley, mostly strawberry and blueberry. Uh, when this flavor first came out, they promoted pomegranate being in it as well, but I don't know where that went or if it's a thing anymore. So we'll go ahead. We will crack this tub open for the first time. And this is still up on the website. It is part of their um, almost gone. So I'm guessing that you know, there's not a lot of time to get this. The only time I've ever seen this flavor pop up just outside of, you know, just being up on the website right now is during BOGO. So they restocked this for a BOGO. And that's when I went ahead and uh, picked this flavor up. So let's go ahead. We will get the top open here. We will get this cracked open. And let's go ahead and get a smell here. Definitely, definitely still got that phase berry smell to it. That smells good. And if you guys don't know, if you go way, 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 way back on my channel, like to the beginning of me doing G Fuel videos, phase berry was, I think, the fourth tub of G Fuel that I ever bought, if not the third. I can't fully remember, but it was one of the very, very, very early flavors of G Fuel that I A tried and B bought a tub of. So we're definitely getting to retry some some history here today. All right, so smell wise, it smells like Faysberry. It just smells fruity, right? That's the best way to put it. It doesn't necessarily smell like one thing over the other, but it just smells fruity. Also, here's the powder on the inside. It's a white powder. If I'm not mistaken, I think Faysberry's always been a white powder, so nothing new there. And we'll go ahead, take the water bottle piece off because I don't need it. And we do have got our typical G Fuel Gamma Labs shaker cup here with us today. So let's go ahead and get a scoop of this berry bomb flavor. It's gonna take me a while to be able to call this berry bomb, but let's go ahead. We'll get ourselves a scoop of berry bomb. Now, one thing that I am interested in because this is a new formula of G Fuel. I never tried the new formula of Phase Berry, um, but with berry bomb, it is the newer formula. And if you guys don't know, let's go ahead and put this in here. Uh, if you guys don't know what I mean by newer formula, a G Fuel used to have like the 25 calorie formula and now they have the 15 calorie formula. So I've never tried this version. Where I've never tried this version of Phaseberry. And what I do remember from the original Phaseberry is that the flavor overall just tasted kind of not, ch I guess, I guess chalky is the right word, but you definitely had some powder leftover in it so there's that we'll go ahead and get the lid onto our shaker cup make sure it's down nice and tight let's go ahead and check this up all 
Alrighty, and I would say we are shooken up and ready to go. Here is the color that it made. That is just honestly classic color right there. This is exactly the same color as Phase Barrier used to be. So spot on there. I'm guessing overall it's going to be the same thing. So let's go ahead. We'll pop the top here. Definitely get more of that strawberry and blueberry like mixed smell to it. Oh yeah. All right, well, let's go ahead and try this. This is the Phaseberry Reskin Berry Bomb. Definitely get that strawberry and blueberry taste in it. What I'm not getting in this, which is what I'm super like happy about with this, is I'm not getting that um, kind of chalky taste to it. It's very much like more smoother than what regular Phaseberry was. And if you guys know what I'm talking about by Phaseberry being chalky, it's it's not that at all with this one. It's smooth. Um, yeah, it's very smooth. And I'm guessing that that's the uh, that's the new formula to thank for it, just out of curiosity. We do have got some powder sitting on the bottom. That's why I always recommend, if you're drinking GVU, to always give it a little bit of a shake uh, before you take a sip, because as it settles over time, more powder will settle to the bottom. But, man. This is just a classic G Fuel fruit flavor. Um, definitely more of a real fruit, fruit than a candy or anything like that. But what I can tell you is, is it tastes the exact same as Phaseberry. So if you guys ever had Phaseberry G Fuel, you guys would love this. Um, and if you've never had Phaseberry G Fuel, or maybe you've never had G Fuel in general, this is definitely a flavor that I would recommend starting out with because it is just a classic strawberry blueberry taste to it and it was definitely always one of those flavors that were recommended to people as a starting flavor for it so yeah that's really good that's really good personally i could probably add another like scoop or uh add another half scoop maybe to it or a little bit more powder to it um but even just like this, it's very good. It's nothing, it tastes the same as original Phaseberry, but without the chalkiness. And I really like that. So this flavor, definitely a thumbs up for me, especially if you've ever had Phaseberry in the past. Uh, it's basically the same thing, just without the chalkiness. So Berry Bomb G Fuel, really good. Definitely a flavor that I would look at if you are looking for, you know, your first flavor or something like that. Um, if I had to give this flavor a rating, comparing it to what is out now, and does it hold really the test of time? Um, I don't know. There are some great flavors. If I'm rating the flavor just by itself, it's definitely still like an 8 out of 10, I would say. But, you know, you look at some of the flavors that are out now and they're a little bit better, in my opinion. But this one's still just, if you're looking for, you know classic like OG G Fuel flavor this is one of them because this one is one of the ones that are up on the website that's still kind of considered part of like that OG group when the uh, tubs used to have different labels on them and stuff like that but definitely very good very good G Fuel flavor so if you guys like I said looking for a first flavor that's it if you guys were somebody that loved Fazeberry that's it for you and you know if you're somebody that likes the real fruit flavors definitely I would go for it as well for me I'm happy that I have a tub of it uh, it's definitely going to be one that gets rotated in and um, you know drank but as far as where I would rank it though that's going to have to wait until next week to see if it makes it into my top 10 uh, because top 10 kind of crowded right now and even just since the beginning of the week since I announced doing that top 10 video I've already made changes to it myself uh, so stay tuned for that video next week. 
Um, and other than that, guys, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Thank you guys for watching this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, smash the like button down below. Remember to subscribe to the channel for more videos. And I will catch you guys in the next one.